I at least now have my nausea under control. Um, so that's good. Um, but it's been like being in labor since the 17th. Chelsea Titus says she has been living with intense pain from endometriosis since September 17th. Doctors where she lives in Boise, Idaho, can't schedule the needed surgery to remove an ovary. The Idaho Department of Health and Welfare has activated crisis standards of care, postponing surgeries because hospitals are filled with COVID patients. We have certainly struggled with vaccination rates, as we know, and that struggle has translated into a hospital system and a health care uh, system that's overwhelmed. I have no doubt that I would be at home recovering from surgery had it not been overwhelmed with COVID patients. Instead, Titus is a long way from home. She's here in the Bay Area. Desperate for relief, she talked with her doctor and decided to come here to El Camino Hospital in Mountain View for surgery. California has the lowest COVID transmission rate in the country and some of the highest vaccination rates. Titus says the difference in medical care here is drastic. There was two other patients the entire time. Whereas um, urgent care in Boise is incredibly busy. She says the procedure is scheduled tomorrow. If all goes well, she can go home next week. A medical journey costing her thousands of extra dollars. Enrages me that people who don't have the resources that I have um, are stuck in their state in Idaho not able to get the surgeries they need. She's hoping sharing her story will help convince people to get vaccinated. Jean Ellie, NBC Bay Area News.